off. First on Fox tonight, a local baker says he has the right to deny a same-sex couple a wedding cake. But now the Attorney General's office is investigating the Gresham business. KPTV's Laura Rios talked to the baker and joins us live from Gresham with the details, Laura. Shauna, Oregon law prohibits discrimination based on sexual orientation, but Aaron Klein of Sweet Cakes Bakery tells me he believes he is within his rights to refuse to make a cake for a same-sex wedding. I have one of those. Aaron Klein stays busy making sales at Sweet Cakes, the Gresham bakery he runs with his wife, except when he has a reason not to. I've been cleaned out. A complaint filed with Oregon's Department of Justice alleges Klein turned customers away for a different reason. They wanted to buy a cake for a same-sex marriage. According to the complaint, Klein called the couple, quote, abominations unto the Lord, then said their money was, quote, not equal. I never told anybody they were an abomination. Klein denies he made those statements, but admits he did turn one of the brides-to-be and her mother away. She, being the, the girl, giggled a little bit and said, it's two brides. At that point, I stopped what I was doing. I looked at them. I said, I'm sorry. Uh, I may have wasted your time. We don't do same-sex marriages. From the Bible on the counter to the faith decoration on the wall, Klein and his wife make their religious beliefs well known to customers. The bakery's website says they, quote, strongly believe that when a man and woman come together to be joined as one, it's truly one of the most special days of their lives. And while Oregon law prohibits discrimination based on sexual orientation, Klein says his beliefs protect him. First Amendment, Constitution, uh, freedom of religion. I'm free to exercise my religion however I see fit. I should not be compelled to violate my conscience. If I am told that I have to make a wedding cake for a same-sex marriage, I feel that I'm violating my beliefs. I don't think I should have to do that. Klein is willing to accept the consequences, whether that means losing business or getting into trouble with the state. I'd rather stand up for what I believe in and what I feel is right and get totally annihilated when it comes in the end than to bow down to this and say, go ahead, because that, sends, that sets the standard for the next one and the next one and the next one. Now, the couple who filed this complaint referred me to their attorney. He declined to comment tonight. Now, the, deter the Department of Justice, excuse me, is waiting for a client to respond to this complaint in writing, and after that, they will decide whether or not to continue this investigation. Reporting live in Gresham, I'm Laura Rios, the 10 o'clock news.